You know what? When I was at basic training, one of my friends, who's actually in the Skid Army Discord server, Dilius, if you can find him, um, he said that Phantom Forces would make a good game to just kinda play and talk, you know? Like a podcast game almost, or like, you know, if you if you streamed, I guess. If you were some sort of Twitch nerd, you could play and stream. Now, I'm no Twitch nerd, and I don't run a podcast, but I have a YouTube channel, which is about half the sum of those parts, which is better. And so, you know what? That's what we're going to be doing today. No, I'm not doing so good this round, <laughs> out the gate. Okay, but that's going to turn around soon enough, trust me. Alright, you just wait and see. But, uh, yeah. I'm going to be making a couple videos like this just to be like, uh... Do you remember the vacant videos I uploaded while I was gone at basic? These are going to be a lot like that because... I don't know how things are going to change when I go to college. Recording wise, like what I'm able to do, what my capabilities are and stuff, and the time constraints and all that. Not sure how any of that's going to work, but I still want to try to keep a good uploading schedule while I figure all that out. So, I'm going to record a bunch of videos like this, where it's probably just me talking and playing or whatever. Just like the vacant videos, and those are going to be uploaded in my stead while I figure out what's going on. That being said, enjoy the video, if you want to watch it. I mean, it's all up to you, you're the consumer here. Wow, that was bad. That was bad. Don't know why as soon as I turn the camera on I lose my edge. But I swear that's how it goes. I know it sounds like saying the fish that got away was bigger, but it's true, I swear. Yeah, I gotta believe me. What is up with my aim today? That's better. This honey badger. I've started using the honey badger again. Oh wait, I'm low on ammo. Alright, hopefully one of these dudes... Okay, I guess it doesn't matter much anymore. Um, yeah, the honey badger, one of the oldest weapons that I remember using in this game. This, the G36C, I remember using the Remington 870, like back in the olden times when Phantom Forces, like the, uh, it was all ugly and stuff, and the loadout screen, like the menu screen was like, you're in some room. And they had like these posters on the walls. There's one that was like a movie poster. It's like, I'll come home. I remember that. That was when I started using this weapon. And it was good then. And I always hear, actually, funnily enough, it was because of an iFunny meme. There was a Phantom Forces feature, which is odd in itself. But everyone in the comments was talking about it. And they were like, man, the Honey Badger's overpowered. I'm like, hey, you're right. I wonder if it's still overpowered. So I went and I picked it up again. I got a fancy skin slapped on it, and now, turns out, yes, it is still just as good as it was. Damage is kind of low. I don't know if this muffler I have on it actually reduces damage. I think in the description of the muffler it said it didn't reduce damage. But I still wanted to have it suppressed, you know, because one, it helps, I think suppression helps control the recoil a bit. I might be wrong on that, though. And two, it's a honey badger. It's got to be suppressed. Come on. Well, I was doing good for a second there, but it looks like the tables have turned. Yeah, I see ya. I see ya. Yes, this gun's like a three, four shot kill, depending on how many headshots you get. And the fire rate is a tiny bit on the slower side for an automatic rifle, but still good enough to be good. Is it the same guy that kills me every time? Man, the L86 is a disgusting looking weapon. Vile. Makes me wretch just thinking about it. 
Wow, none of those shots hit that guy. Zero. Zero of those, what, 26 shots, bullets I flung in that direction, ended up finding their target. Don't see how that was a long shot, but I'll take the points. I will take them in a heartbeat. Uh-oh, where'd I go? You don't know. I was right behind you the whole time. I can't do a delirious voice. Oh, that's a lot. Got him. Right, where's this other guy? I hear him moving around in the sand somewhere, but there's no sand around here. Oh, unless he's up top. Found ya. You're next. Easy mode. We are beasting with the honey badger. It doesn't care. Uh-oh. Might care about those guys. That's one kill. Dude, marking players is so overpowered. Uh-oh. Gotta break out the Tech-9! Just for a little bit, while we get back on our feet, ammo-wise. I hear that- yeah, those footsteps are way too loud to be a teammate. That's the thing, is if you hear some pretty loud footsteps right next to you, it's never, ever your teammate. It's always a bad guy. Without fail. This is, of course, by design. That man is still alive. The Krinkov is another good weapon. I might, I might do some rounds with that. I tried it out, and I am pleased, pleasantly surprised at the quality of the weapon. I think it's technically a, well, like an AKS 74U or something like that. Obviously, some AK variant. But I guess in the American market, they just call them Krinkovs. Yeah, I was out of ammo that time. What a shame. Cannot be helped. Well, maybe it could be helped if I just hit my targets. You know, like a normal person. Like a good soldier. You know what good soldiers do? They follow orders. Good soldiers follow orders. Oh, come on! I hit sprint and it cancelled my aiming. I was about to kill that guy too. Alright. Oh, it stole my kill. Why'd you have to go and do that? Why can't you just be bad like all my other teammates? Come on, teammate! Alright. Maybe we don't want to be over here. Let's see if we can find some ammo. No, no. No. Yeah, I heard that. Dang, I cannot track. I cannot track when I'm aiming in close. Oh, that is it. He's dancing on my corpse. I will show that man. Also, the muzzle drop from the uh, the bullet drop from the this weapon is pretty brutal. But that's okay, because you're really not supposed to be using it at long range anyway. Now let's see if we can find someone who spawned not at our spawn. That's about as far out as we'll get, I guess. Hello. Goodbye. Hello. Once again, I cannot track close in. The bison. Um, I think the judgment I delivered on the bison was that it was not a good weapon. I think. I don't remember though, I haven't used it in a while. Also, is it just me, or did they change all of the AK sounds? They all sound, like, wussier now. They sound different, more like, like a clack 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 kind of deal. Than a boom 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 kind of deal, you know? But all the AKs make it. What do you mean spotted by enemy? There we go. No one suspects a thing. Sneak attack! Got him. Uh-oh. 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 Alright, um... Jump out of here! Not a good place to be. It's about to get overrun by enemies any second now. And we're gonna go back in. This time from the ground floor. 
Oh, oh, I see you. Got him. Oh, shouldn't have jumped that wall, buddy. Should have stayed behind cover. All right, what are we looking at? 43 kills and four minutes left. We can make it to 50. We can make it to 50, that's the goal. There's a bad guy. A fine, oh, he really was gonna be a fine addition to my collection before his friend came and saved him. Okay. You know what, I'm gonna find some lo-fi hip-hop music to put behind all these videos. Ouch. Ouch! My brain does that thing as if I'm shooting at one guy. Like, if there's one guy, then yeah, I'll, I'll aim at that guy. But if there's two guys or three guys, my aim goes to, like, the point in space between those three guys. Like, the mean, the average center of mass of those three people, which is usually none of them. It's usually just the air. What is everyone doing stacked up there? No clue, but I'm moving up. Stay left, because there's people over here. Like that man. Out of here. Out of here. Oh, dude's on the hill. Oh, I know what to do. I know exactly what to do. I'm going to go up here. Swap this out for that. Oh, it's a DMR. It's not even a sniper. Give me the AWS back. Give it back. That's better. Now we can just boink. Boink. Up, oh, bullet drop. Boink. Okay. His SFG 50 with that little barrel still had better muzzle velocity. This is why all sniper rifles are bad, except for the. Uh, I wouldn't say bad, but all sniper rifles are inferior to the BFG. It's just a fact of life, and some people can't handle the facts. That was dumb. Let's hop right back in. And spawned right into a shotgun blast. I love when that happens. Oh, and he's dancing. And he's dancing. Oh, that was a baddie. Who are they trying to kick? Sean Creepington. No, 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 no. Sean. Sean. Where'd you come from? <laughs> No, they kicked him! They kicked Sean Creepington! What the heck? Dude. Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute. My settings are set so that people can't join me. Like, friends can't join me. So... That was total chance. I think. I don't know, let me double check real quick. Let me go over to my settings. Settings, privacy, who can join me? No one. No one can join me. Which means that Sean Creepington, my top lieutenant, just joined Phantom Forces and happened to end up in my server. And they kicked him. Oh, that's bad. They kicked Sean for no reason. Unless Master Guard, Gundam, and all these people, unless somehow they know who he is. There's no- that is Sean Creep- that is Sean! That's the one and only! Okay. What a coincidence. Cause like, think about the thousands of people who are playing this game consecutively. What? Oh, close match though, let's see what we got. No, we didn't even get the 50! What a coincidence though, Sean showed up. I'll have to DM him about that later. Alright, explain to me. Explain to me why you did it. He was hacking. Sean was not hack- Sean's not a hacker. He just joined the server. How? I don't buy it. Also, we've got probably the worst game mode on the worst map. I don't know about the worst map, but it's definitely up there on the bad map scale. Alright, we gotta figure out a way to get downstairs. I don't know how. 
Can we get downstairs over here? No, how do we get down there? Oh, here's a bridge. That probably lets us downstairs. Yep. Yeah, boy. What a sad event. Who's this? Not my not my Sean Creepington more like. Poor guy. I'll make fun of that man later. Sweet, we gotta move on. Dude, this game mode is so goes by so quickly sometimes. Like you just put a lot of people in the uh, in the circle. You get like five people in the circle. You get like five points per second, or like ten points per second. It's over, and my teammates left. They don't know how hard point works. You got to stay in the point, because when you leave, it turns white. You idiots. Well, you know what? If you're not doing it, I'm not doing it. I'm after kills. Sitting in a point isn't entertaining. No siree. I'm after blood. Out for the violence of it. Where'd that man come from? Okay, doesn't matter. You know what? Recently I've been looking at ARs. ARs and plate carriers to buy. So far, the Smith & Wesson M&P uh, 15, I believe it is, seems like a decent AR for the price. Because I'm not about to spend like, you know, $2,000 on an AR. But you gotta have one, you know, everyone should have one. So that, and then also, plate carriers wise, I think it's called like, turtle shell or something like that. Something shell. Sold by US Patriot Tactical. Seemed appealing, but expensive, so I might keep looking over in that, in that department. Dude, where are these bad guys coming from? Look, that's a bad guy, shoot him! Come on, teammate. Come on, I'll do it myself. There we go. This point is ours. Jeez. Bad guy, they're coming in the windows. Oh, that's not a bad guy. Everyone looks blue for some reason. I do like how everyone's got helmets now. One, it makes your head stick out less. Stand out less, you know, this big white spot. And two, it makes more sense that people will be wearing helmets. It doesn't change ballistics, I don't think, which is fine by me. Oh, yeah, he saw me. He saw me. Come on down to the tunnel. Get your free breadstick. Muzzle booster? What does that do? Hang on. Barrel muzzle booster. Rate... Rounds per minute increase. No, I don't want reduced suppression, and I don't want less, um, more recoil. The recoil on this weapon is higher than I remember, which is why I even have a suppressor on it at all. Mostly. Oh, he just take my gun? He did. I can't let him commit acts of terror with my weapon. I'm gonna end the threat. Actually, no. You can commit a couple of acts. Just a couple. Because I'm going over here. Whoop. You don't hear me. There's nobody. Oh. Come on. I hate when I... Something about the loadout that I have makes it so if I shoot people enough times... Like, let's see. So let's do some math. 33 damage. Yep. So, if I'd shoot someone three times and none of them are headshots, then they will be at one health. And that gets rather infuriating sometimes. I see you in the window. Who was that Catterman? Ouch! Is that a gold AK? That's pretty sweet. Golden guns are cool. Some guns definitely look better in gold than others, though. Jeez, he is hopping all over the place. At least my teammate managed to take him down. Man, well, I don't want to stay on the point the whole time, but I also don't want to lose, so... 
What's up? Did I not get any kills? What happened to that first guy that I shot? Because I shot him like four times. He just disappeared. Alright, where's the point? Where's the point? Where's the point? Oh, it's over there. Yeah, no, I don't want to lose, so we're going to start trying to play the point a bit more. Whoop. Whoop. No! Alright, my legs aren't as spry as they typically are. Usually I'd be hopping. Oh, here we go. Here's a point. It's not easy to hold, though. Where's this dude come from, I swear? Also, people who just jump, like just jump around and look all over the place passively when they're not even getting shot at, are some of the most annoying things. Yeah, come get me. Got him! <laughs> I hit him with that grenade under my body trick that they did in Red Dawn. No. Why was I crouched? I was hitting shift to sprint that whole time. Okay. Man, that man was like a hair away from getting jade keyed. We are moving up. Moving up to take this point. Out of here. Out of here. Oh, the point's moved. Lovely. Wait, we can go downstairs there? I kind of want to see what's down there. Dang. That man's a higher level than I thought he was. See, once you start playing this game long enough, you can sort of predict the way people move. And the way, what what usually would have happened is he would have followed me through that window. So if you pre-fire into the window, you'll usually catch someone like that. How's our KDR looking? Less than two, that is not good. I'm trying to, like, one of my secondary goals is to get my KDR, to, my total KDR to two. Which so far has proven difficult. See? Like, I heard that man coming, so I just kinda... Wait, how has the point moved already? I mean, at least we're already on it, I guess. Don't know where that guy went. Nor do I particularly care. Oh, this is where that basement part comes out to. Dang it. I went to toss a nade in there just to keep his head down, but... It was too slow. Grenades activate too slow in this game. They need to make it quicker. Add to the high speed element. That's the AK man. Do not let him get away. That was a teammate that I just started to light up. Yeah, no, we're not going to win this. I don't really like this game mode. Don't like all the movement it entails. Oh, there's a dude on the stairs the whole time just watching me kill his comrades. Nice. Well, thank you for leaving me alone for long enough to finish the job. Oh, see, that's what I'm talking about. The last three bullets in my magazine took him down to one health. And I get an assist, which doesn't even count towards your weapon kills. Like, towards, like, unlocks for attachments and stuff. When your assist counts as a kill. No matter. Man, we're not doing so hot this round. Not one bit. We're not doing terrible, but not good. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. Oh, we had a shotgun! That's a triple kill, though. We're starting ever so slowly to repair our KDR. If we can get to 40 kills, then we should be in range to actually not drag our overall... Actually, no. We need to get higher. Higher than a 2 KDR. Because if we get a 2 at the point we're at, then our total KDR still goes down. Because you're adding... It's math, trust me. Like, if my total KDR was 1.5, and say I got 
you know, a KDR of 2, say I got 20 kills and 20 deaths, then my overall KDR would not be at 2. It would either, it might raise a tiny bit, but it's not going to be at 2 no matter how many times that happens. So if, even if it starts at 2 and you start getting 2 KDRs like that, it won't get there. I don't know. I worked it all out in my head one time. I do not know how my bullets just went through that that giant <laughs> iron bridge. Also, yes, I totally would have killed you, AK guy. I know I've got a weaker gun, but I oh we're on the same team now. You know what? That, that's the end of this video. We're gonna just stop recording and start again for next video. Hey, it's Alan Fire. What's up? Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll hit you with the outro.